YouTube, it's Satch. Welcome to Drive 81. You join me in the cockpit of this Mercedes-Benz E-Class W212. Uh, this is my daily driver. It has 157,000 miles on the clock. It's an absolute workhorse. And I need to give it some love because I haven't really driven it too much in the past few weeks. I've been too preoccupied with driving everything else that's been thrown my way. So it's good to get back in the, uh, the cockpit of the Mercedes. <music> And this morning I'm on my way back down to uh, my local racetrack which is called Croft Circuit. Although I'm not actually racing or I'm not actually uh, participating today. Um, I know two guys that are going down there so I thought I'd go down there, offer a bit of support, uh, just basically kick some tyres with them, look at all the cars that are that are going down there and uh, participating on track. I have got my helmet with me, so I will be looking to uh, sign on and get some passenger laps in. Hopefully I'll be able to stick a couple of cameras in there in whatever I can get into. But the two guys that I know, well, the first guy, he's got a, a Westfield it's a, with a Hayabusa engine. It's a 1.3 Hayabusa engine. In. That car actually goes like stink. I've done this car, this circuit before, um, but it was cut short after about a lap because um, clutch issues, the car was overheating and it just it just broke down it broke basically um, so it was a bit of a waste of time that day unfortunately but the car is supposedly running perfect now um, so that's one guy the other guy has a, um, a car which I'm actually looking for at the minute it's a Carrera 4S a 996 Carrera 4S I'm in the market for one of those so if you know of a good one black one or blue one uh, then give me a shout but anyway that aside uh, he's got a category B which means this car is not actually legal for the roads. It can only be used off-road. So the racetrack is a perfect place to put it. The only, probably one of the only places you can put it. Um, well, that's a nice silver car. Um, as I say, it's, it's been fully restored to the way it was. He's going to go down the route of putting cage in, um, seat, bucket seats in. You know, the whole works. Makes make it. Look a nice, a nice looking track car, and a nice, uh, nice little weapon. Uh, so I'm getting down there now on my way to Croft, as I say. I'll see you down there. Hey, have you been out? I mean, no, I'm just trying to get this lap time. How's it running? It's it's okay. It's um, the gearbox is a lot. The gearbox is a lot better with the new oil in. Right. It's it's okay. Illegal. Right, it's time to now go out in the Westfield.
great stuff, great stuff. The Westfield is a fantastic car. Uh, but now I'm gonna go out in the uh, Carrera 4S. 320 brake horsepower. Come on, let's go. Does he work on the railways? What? Does he work on the railways? Oh, he's playing up. Oh, he's playing up. You're a good fancy, Do you know this guy? <laughs> It does have a few flaws. Not saying it's not quick enough because it's perfect for this type of day, uh, but the suspension needs sorting. Uh, it needs bucket seats because even though it's a 4S, the car is sliding around. Um, tires are warmed up, but it just needs a bit, a bit more stiffer suspension and also uh, better seats, better bucket seats. I 
guys, another one bites the dust, another track day done and dusted. Uh, although it wasn't my day to actually do any driving today, um, I did manage to sneak on five or six laps in the 911, uh, 996 Carrera 4S, a car again that I am looking to, uh, to pick up and buy. Both cars, a lot of fun, obviously the Westfield and the 911, two completely different animals on the track. The Westfield that we've been out in, we've had problems with it the past few occasions, however, it's so close, it's 95% to being perfect. Um, and I've just been speaking to the guy there who owns the car, and of course he's probably gonna get it perfect and, and then probably sell it. He's interested in one of these uh, radicals, but uh, we'll see, we'll see. So thanks for watching. Nothing really too exciting, too strenuous today in fact. Uh, it's just been a nice, relaxed, chilled out day, surrounded by a lot of uh, race cars and uh, powerful performance cars. So thanks for watching, see you next time, please like and please subscribe.